I mean, with artificial intelligence, we are summoning the demon. You know, all those stories where there's the guy with the pentagram and the holy water. It didn't work out. The proliferation of AI is now among us. Everything from rent prices to the military is now being controlled by AI. Sir, the Pentagon has proposed that we use our AI to search and destroy for any hint of the virus. We put everything from satellites to missile silos under the control of a single computer system. Yeah, I still prefer to keep humans in the loop. I'm not sure Skynet's ready. business are you in? We predict the future. The best way to predict the future is to invent it. In this video we're going to explore the world of AI image generation using a program called Stable Diffusion. And I'm going to ask it to show us things that we were not supposed to see. The first thing I'm going to do is ask it to show us a picture of the spirit realm. As you can see they came out a little bit generic. So let's see if we can make it a little more interesting. Now things are starting to come into view. Now let's take it one step further and ask to show us how the spirit realm is interacting with the land of the living. As you can see by the results, it is showing us what I ask it to show us. Now I think we can dial it in a little bit more. Let's see what demonic spirits are doing to unaware people living on this earth. And now let's narrow it down even more. As you can see, things are starting to get creepy. Fast. So let's go ahead and take a step back and ask it to show us what Bible verses look like. For instance, let's start off with Ephesians 6.12. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Just as I thought, the AI doesn't really know what's going on here, so let's refine it a little bit. Now things are starting to get interesting. Here we are seeing the fallen angels who, according to the Bible, control the world and influence humanity. Let's keep going. I'm going to ask it to show us a Nephilim. Which is an ancient Hebrew word for half human, half fallen angel entity. It's a hybrid being. Half fallen angel, half human, who are literal giants. Ranging from anywhere from 9 to 30 feet tall, according to the sources. Now what happens if I ask it to show me one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse? This is what we get. It almost mirrors scripture perfectly. We have the gray horse with death as the rider. Now let's ask it to show us what the antichrist is going to look like. So this is what AI thinks will be the antichrist. Interesting. We know from scripture that the Antichrist is going to be a man possessed by the spirit of Satan himself. Is this what we are seeing here? Could be. Here we have a Nephilim hybrid being giving a speech at the United Nations. And here's a few more. And let's see what an extraterrestrial being looks like if it's giving a speech to the public. Look at this one, how it has six fingers. The Bible says that Nephilim have six fingers and six toes. Is it just a coincidence that the AI is producing images with six finger hybrid beings? Now 
Now let's look at Barack Obama speaking with an extraterrestrial alien being. And look, again, it shows two Barack Obamas, but one of them has six fingers, just like how the Bible says Nephilim have six fingers. Interesting. Here's Barack Obama shaking hands with an alien being. And here's a few more. Now let's ask this AI to show us an extraterrestrial being at a crashed UFO site in Roswell, New Mexico. Now I'm going to ask it to show me an extraterrestrial being as a world leader. So here we have some images of somebody that looks like Donald Trump and other human beings mixed with obvious alien beings pretending to be world leaders. Here I typed in historic photograph of a Nephilim hybrid standing with U.S. Army soldiers in 1845. Here is Nephilim at the White House. Now I'm going to ask it to show us who the real modern day Illuminati are. Look at their faces. They look like half human, half monster hybrids. Here's the Freemason's Eye of Lucifer. Imagined. And a Baphomet. And faces of people that seem to be crossbred with aliens. The future of humanity. And it's showing me destroyed pictures of Washington, D.C. Does AI know something is coming? Does it know something that we don't know? Why does it think our future is destruction? Zombies and monstrous beings wearing army uniforms. Now I'm going to ask AI to show us the pyramids in Antarctica. and the pyramids on the moon.
And here are some pyramids from Mars. Here are some maps of Atlantis. And last but not least, I'm going to ask the AI to show us the real rulers of humankind. And these are the rulers of humanity, according to AI. Notice how it's showing alien beings, hybrid entities, as the true rulers of mankind. Which, by the way, is exactly what the Bible says in Ephesians 6.12, when it says, for our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Coincidence? You be the judge. I want to thank you all for watching this video, and until next time, God bless you all.